The other implication of this that I want to mention just of Rabbi Shrahli Sadri is when you go and Musa alayhi salam we know when he sees injustice he gets angry. It, it angers him. And he takes matters in his own hand like he did with the two girls and the sheep. So when he sees Fir'aun, he's one of the worst criminals in all of human history. Obviously the kinds of things Fir'aun says would make anybody angry, not to mention Musa alayhi salam. When Fir'aun says, Ana rabbukum wal a'la, la hawla wa la quwwata illa billah. He says, I am your highest master, I am the Rabb, you know. لَعَلِّي أَطَّلِعُوا إِلَىٰ إِلَٰهِ مُوسَىٰ He says things like, oh, let me make on my own tower, I'll go climb and talk to Musa's God myself. That's what he says in the Qur'an. When he says things like that, even it makes us angry. Can you imagine Musa alayhi salam? And by the way, when you get angry, you cannot do da'wah. When you get angry, you cannot do da'wah. So even though he's going to go before someone who will make him very angry, he needs to keep his chest calm. He needs to keep it expanded. He cannot get uncomfortable. So we're learning that the, the mission of Allah, of talking to those who have rebelled against Allah, has to be carried by people who know how to control their temper. And if they cannot control their temper, if they have an anger problem, then they have to turn to Allah and say, Rabbi shrahli sadri. My master, ease me. Calm my chest. A lot of young people are excited about da'wah. They go to the university. They see their non-Muslim friend and they start, or they see a Muslim brother who doesn't pray or whatever and they start giving them da'wah and this guy doesn't care about deen and he starts saying some ridiculous things that make you angry. Well the Qur'an, you know, it has some contradictions or I don't know, I don't really believe in hadith or whatever. They say some stupid things and then you hear them, you're what? It's kufr man! And you get so angry at them. And that's the time to remember, Rabbi shrahli sadri. Rabbi shrahli sadri. If Musa alayhi salam has to speak with Fir'aun wa qula lahu qawlan layyinan qawlan layyinan la'allahu yatadhakkar aw yakhshah then what does that leave you? The guy sitting next to you in the restaurant is not Fir'aun buddy, relax. Relax. Take it easy. People can say obnoxious things. This guy used to say he's God himself. And Allah said be nice to him too. <laughs> be nice to him also. So we need to learn to calm down a little bit. This is the meaning of this dua. What's the point of these duas if we don't reflect on them? And we don't under, understand what Allah Azza wa is saying. Qala Rabbi shrahli sadri. Ya Allah, keep my chest calm. I need to have confidence and I need to have calmness.